She had friends among the Dominican sisters, and she made a pact with them. She was undecided as to what she wanted to do with her life, but she said, if Mother Gerald Berry ever purchased a little hospital in the West, that would be her sign that she had a vocation to Adrian. She went to Miami, Florida for the dedication of Berry College in 1940, and there she heard that Mother Gerald had indeed purchased a little hospital in Santa Cruz, California. That was the sign, and now she had to tell her father. This is a story of an ordinary woman gifted with extraordinary courage and radiant faith who carved a new path for the future, responsive to the call of her Dominican vocation. Today, her work to establish quality health care facilities in the West continues to serve countless individuals. Born in Chicago in 1918, Sister Georgianne Duggan first met the Adrian Dominican sisters when they began teaching her in the fifth grade. The sisters instilled not only a solid foundation of science and math that led her to become a nurse, but ingrained a faith that would lead her to join the congregation. Only a few weeks after she entered the congregation as a novice, Sister Georgianne became one of the first five sisters sent from Adrian to Santa Cruz, California. They were pioneers who established the Adrian Dominican Healthcare Ministry at Sisters Hospital. Sister Georgianne was the only nurse among them. The reputation of the hospital grew as a holy place, drawing the appreciation and support of a grateful Santa Cruz community that has continued to the present day. What started out as a 28-bed hospital grew to what is today the 379-bed Dominican Hospital. Her 48 years of ministry included nursing and hospital administration in Santa Cruz and at St. Rose Dominican Hospital in Henderson, Nevada. Well, my memories of Sister Georgiana Duggan is that in the 60s, I would come in from Winslow, Arizona to the hospital in Henderson, Rose de Lima, and she would be there with Sister Marie Bridget. Those are the two I remember the best. Sister Georgiana was the first nurse that went to Santa Cruz to open that hospital. And it was in pretty bad shape. You know, it was in disarray and she got it together. And she was a really dedicated nurse. The impression she left on me was that she really knew what she was doing. And so when I went there in 92, we just had the one hospital, but now we have three. Santa Cruz, I mean, there was a book written about the history of Santa Cruz. Um, and, and also when you see pictures of what happened in Henderson, you see Sister Georgianne. We've had congressmen and senators and people that have been patients at our hospital that since they were little children. So often we're lobbying for changes in healthcare and they know who we are. But we still have three sisters there. Uh, one of them still works for the hospital, and, and two of them are Eucharistic ministers. And two of them actually teach a lot of the outreach classes. We have four outreach locations. The people love it that we still have sisters there. 